my makeshift visual on a 1973 Fender Jazz Bass. Uh, it's all original except it has a 60s uh, bridge on it. This has the better saddles. We can move the strings back and forth to get it perfect. I got six or seven basses from this bass player in Ohio. This was a professional bass player. Uh, every single bass was set up with a straight neck. And they've been worked on by a luthier guitar tech all his life. These are like... In my, I can't play bass. But in my opinion, these are perfect sounding playing basses that I got. So here I am with the bridge pickup. I am not a bass player, so just get over that. This is a visual. It's set up, uh, in my opinion... Lower action for a bass. I can't play bass, but here it goes. So now uh, with the jazz, I just play around though I get a tone I like. I'm going through an Ampeg Porta Bass 250. Show you in a minute. It's just a nice little bass amp I got.
and we borrow this little electric heater I have up the shop when I'm eating pures. They were four hundred dollars when I bought them. Now they're like eighty bucks. I got a furnace up in my shop here, but and the shop is insulated nice, but you know the windows are kind of Menards cheap. You know, I ain't like the house. The house is toasty. My shop is like. Let's focus in here. Yeah. So I'm showing the visual of the base. Now, you know, hey, at least I'm doing this. Uh, this is like a, a, a pro base. I mean, the truss rod has a whole bunch of room in and out. It's not all the way in or all the way out. I don't like stuff like that. It can still be a good guitar, but you're, you're at your wit's end. The next straightest can be straight edge, bam, right there. It, I can't play bass. Let's just get over that part. But if you ever wanted a 73 jazz bass, and uh, it's a light one. It's not heavy. I can't play bass, but I know vintage. It comes with original covers, original case. It's all original except it has a, I think he told me a 65 bass bridge on it. These are the better saddles. Sorry. So if you want this great bass, EddieVegas.com. And uh, here's my little lamp I have. 